All right, Jamal says he's ready to fight for the one he loves. <laughs> Jamal, what's going on? So basically, Jerry, I'm here because, you know, I want to fight for my wife. You know, oh, we've okay. been through a lot of things. Uh, we've How been long have you been married? We've been married for five years. Oh. We've been together a total of eight, though. Oh, wow. Yeah, so got four kids and everything. Oh, good for you. Okay. But you're saying you, you want to fight for her. What's going on? Why are you? Well, basically, Jerry, uh, during the time of her first pregnancy, yeah. uh, I had enlisted in the military. Yes. And, you know, going through a lot of the stuff that the military does to you, you yeah. know, it kind of changes somebody, you know. Yeah. So uh, when I had flew her out there, you know, I was kind of cold and mean to out her. Out where? Um, out to Alaska. Oh, that's where you were based? Yes, sir. Got it. Yeah. Okay, and, so she um, comes out. Yep. And while she was out there, you know, I would leave her at the house by herself with the kids. You mm -hmm. know, I would go hang out with my friends, go to parties, strip clubs, and stuff like that. Uh, and, you was know, the country well defended at that moment? <laughs> <laughs> so was there going to be an invasion of the strip club? <laughs> okay. No, but um, yeah, I understand that I did her wrong, and you know, yeah. I'm just I'm here willing to you know try to work things out with her. You You're know? back together with her now? Yeah, she was. Okay. Uh, we had went through something where she was gone for eight months, Ooh. and you know, um, I guess you know I'm just ready to move over all of that. Um, you know, I mean, she's the love of my life. You okay. know, I just want to make. So you want to firm up the relationship? Yes, sir. Okay, well, good. All right. So what? Do you suspect that there's any particular problem going on? Well, we share a phone, um, and yeah. you know, I had seen that she was talking to this guy that she knew from way back when, and um, she he had um, messaged her saying that how, uh, you know, he's back in town, how she should come see him and everything like that. Oh. And, you know, I, you know, right away I messaged him, you know, like, why are you trying to talk back to my wife? You know, like, yeah. that's mine, you know? Sure. So I asked her about it and she tells me that, oh, he's just a friend, it's nothing like that, you know? But I mean, it's happened again to the point where um, he even hit her up you know, a while ago saying how, you know, he wanted to go out to the club and, you oh. know, how he should, how she should um, come out, you know, they should hang out and everything like that. And, you know, I messaged him again, you know, like, why are you still trying to sit here and persistently try to come on to my wife? You know, that's mine. You need to back up, you yeah. know. That's and has your wife been saying, no, I'm not going to do that? No, she, she just, you know, a voice answering me and I feel like she lies about it. Is that who G-Tone is? Yep. Okay. Here's G-Tone. So who you got the for? your wife, bro. What you mean for my What you mean, dude? You think you're gonna come back here and try to talk to my wife? Like you yeah, don't know she Yeah, yeah, I mean, you was never there for her. And you were? Where yeah, you been at? I was there for her. Where you been at this whole time, dude? If she really wanted you, she would have been talking to you, but she ain't. Well, look, look, see, I'm here now, and you know what I'm saying? I was there for you when you was gone for them eight months. You know, she hit my, he, she hit my line. I ain't to hear that, so I don't even know why you even up here. Like, man, look, we met at the club, you know what I'm saying? She was all on me, I was... Dance. Oh, oh really? And then she yeah. started pulling, she started pulling, you know, pulling my shirt off and stuff. So I get ready to leave. You know, she comes, she, you know, says she's like, I want to leave with you, Tony Bear. I'm like, oh, okay, what's up? Like, you oh, know, yeah. came so to that's, my crib, so you, you know? really think you're about to come I in and try to replace me? Oh. Yeah, my time. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You think yeah. so? Yeah. You think so? If she's married to him and they have four kids, wouldn't that kind of be, well, as long as she's married to him, I'll find a woman elsewhere. I mean, wouldn't that be your reaction? I mean, you know what I'm saying? We had, we had our bond, so, you know what I'm saying? You know, she used to come over to my house. We used to play basketball yeah. when yeah. we were teenagers, and, you know, I fell in love with her, and, you know, we oh, had a little... Okay. We had a little bond, and then we dated. But when you talked to her, does she say she would like to be with you? Does she yeah, say I mean, she wants to leave him? I mean, she says she's not happy with him, so yeah. she just kind of feel like she's stuck. Because you know, the only, I mean, the only reason stuck. why he, the only reason why stuck. you there, because you know, you you got the you taking. Dude, care you of can't her even be a man and respect me. So how in the world you think you're gonna be trying to take care of her? 
Like, man, you got to you, you gotta be there for it. No, like, you don't, it, you don't, it you don't, don't even matter, but that ain't even your problem. That's look, the first look, thing. It ain't even your inbox, problem. She in my inbox, though. She in my inbox. Want to wanna be she with me. She in your inbox, but she waking up to me. So what you really think? Well, well, you know what I'm saying? But when you go, you're not around. Not around, she come to me. Right, and you can't even do nothing for her. Well, okay. let's find out what she has to say with it. Here's Ashley. <laughs> really? Whoa. So you think you about to cheat on me with this dude? You know how bad you treated me? You know how, how much you killed me when you were in Alaska? Do you? Yeah. I mean, the, the, the strippers, the, the back page, the Craigslist. I could have been your own personal little stripper. I could have been your own little freak. But instead, instead you wanted to go out, you wanted to treat me like dirt. Look, I don't, but I don't I, care about I that. I tried everything to make it up to you. And Are you serious? Got, let, let, let me not forget, when we got married, I didn't even, you didn't even give me a ring. You used your brother's ring to marry me. So what do you mean? Do I have a ring on my finger? Finger. So how, how the heck am I supposed to feel about that? Really? Yeah, yeah, really. What really? do you mean, so really? So you're just going to step out. Eight years of what we built. It doesn't, huh? it doesn't matter. What do you mean it, it doesn't, doesn't matter? matter? That's you stepping out on us, your family, no, your I'm, kids. I'm you're ste stepping out on all of us. So what do you mean? No, I'm stepping out on you. Don't bring my kids into okay. it. Don't bring my kids into okay. it, baby. Don't get it twisted. Okay. Well, we'll so, see if this little dude can be a dad. We'll see if he can be a man. We'll see, see if he can find that you need. It don't, it don't, it don't we'll matter about being a, you up. It don't matter about being a dad. You're their father. And that's all you good at is being a father, not a husband, because I don't want to be with you at the end of the well, day. I'm glad I'm good at being a father because you suck at being a mom. I'm not trying to hear that. Whatever. Mm, all right. Well, you so can just keep okay. staying out all you want then. How about that? What does that have to do with the kids? Why do you Why do you keep Why do you keep bringing the kids into it? Because there are kids. You should be trying to fix what we have made. Oh my yeah, God. Yeah, it might have been my fault. No, what I'm saying is, even if you're unhappy, we can work it out. You don't ever sit there and try to take time to talk or fix I tried, anything. You know what? Actually, when we got back together, I tried to work it out, but it was just a void that I felt. And, and I, when I went out to the club, you know, I saw Antonio dancing or whatever, and I went over and I started twerking on it. Oh, really? And I started twerking on it, and I'm like, I want to go home with you. I want to twerk on something else, whatever. Oh, okay. I understand that I did wrong, but you, you didn't even give me the time to try to fix it. Well, you should have thought about that in Alaska when you treated me like dirt, because at the end of the day, I don't want to be with you. You think you, you can just spoil me with money and give me whatever I want? It's not even about the money. The time that I do give you, I sacrifice everything. But everything, even when we messed up, all right? Even for the eight months when we weren't together, when you was the one who sit there and have some dude sleeping on our couch, eating our food in front of our kids, right? But you want to sit here and act like I'm nothing, right? Like I messed up real bad, right? But you did. Okay. And you, you broke you broke my heart. You stabbed me when that happened. Ever since then, I haven't been the same. It was a void that I had. So, so, it'll, so you're choosing this joke. Yeah, I'm choosing him. I'd rather be happy. I'd rather be happy than to be miserable for the rest, for the rest of my life. We don't even have sex. Like, we have sex, like, once a week. Like, you don't get it. I you, mean, you it, it must there. have been the best sex you had. You popped out four kids, didn't you? I mean, I was no. Because that was when I was back in Alaska. I got pregnant back to back because of you. You know, yeah, back you in Alaska, you treated me like, like nothing. And you loved it. I did what love What do you I say it. about this? I did you're love listening it. to this. You're saying you want to be with him. Yeah, I, I really do. What do you say to her? I mean, if, I feel like if she's really for real about it, I feel like if she's really for real about it, you know, she would have to cut all ties with her husband. Ain't no and able cut, to no. be unable to be with me, but like you know, he can be there, you know, to take care of the kids. Or nah, uh, and uh, 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 I'm gonna have to stop you right there, man. Ain't nobody about to take care of my kids but me, so I don't even know why you even said that. I mean, you know what I'm saying? I can I can be there for you. Him. Can't you know be what there. Saying? What you mean? You know what I'm saying? What you mean? I can teach them how to dance. Okay. Yeah. You know. And they do like dancing. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? You have a decision to make because I understand you guys are angry at each other, but. Are you really? Because he's still going to be in their life. You, can, mm -hmm. you know, yeah, he's I their father. I can't, I can't. You know, I can't let that. Can't stop that. Oh, so you're saying you're okay with this relationship, but he'll always be there. Yeah, yeah, I'm okay with. Yeah, but, okay. You and know. I'm what telling you? you that I really do want to be with you. I don't want to be with him. I'll do anything to be with you. I drop, drop everything just as long as you know I, I'm in my kid's life, and you're really good. You know, you're a great father too. I'm really ready to work things out with you and start a future with you. <laughs> uh, you're not leaving. 
I don't care what you say. You're not. Do you want to get in the middle of this? I mean, I mean, at, at, at the same time, she has to come to an ultimatum. You know what I'm saying? Like, she has to what? She had to come to c make a decision, like really make a decision. Like, do she really? Do you really want to be with me? I really do, and I'm telling you this. I swear, I really don't. do want to be. I do not want to be with him. I do anything. My phone, you got it. Communication is key, and I will have that with you. Anything you you ask me, I'll tell you the truth about it. This is this is that's the past, and past. I'm ready to go on to the future. Past. Okay, you're still gonna you know. be seeing me when you look at the kids, so I don't even know why you saying pass. Don't they all look like me? Um, what? Don't they all look like me? That's that doesn't matter. I still don't want to be right. with him. So okay. he's you know. Okay, well, you know, we can we can come to all the meta and we can really make this. If you really want to make this work, uh uh. We'll be back. Hey YouTube, thanks for watching. For more Judge Jerry, click here. For more Jerry Springer, click here.